In the video for today, I'm going to show you how to double or triple your Android phone's battery life by changing specific settings. So do you know that there are a lot of apps on your Android phone that is constantly running and the background data or whatever that is being utilized by the application is actually draining out your battery? No, you do not, right? So you could do these things that I'm going to show you so that your battery life improves. So the first thing, is what you could do is put off notifications. Now, to put off notifications, you could go ahead, get to settings directly and just type in notifications out here and just get to notifications directly. I'm doing a notification search directly because we have a lot of Android devices from different brands and different brands have different settings. So you could go ahead and select uh, applications that you don't need notifications from. Okay. For instance, this app, I don't need notifications. Let me put that off. Okay. Then this one, I don't need notifications. Let me put that off. Then uh, maybe this one, I don't need notification. Let me put that off. Okay. So whatever you do not need notifications from, whichever application, just put that off. This is going to contribute to improving your battery life. The next thing is device auto scan. So you could switch off the auto scan that is on your Android device. You get to settings, you scroll down, go to Google, click on all services, click on devices. And then you could switch this off. So your Android device is continuously scanning for devices nearby. So this is not only going to contribute to the improvement for your battery life, but this is also going to reduce phone radiation. And this is not needed to be on also because when you want to connect to a device via Bluetooth, you know, you do a scan and whatever devices are nearby, you could connect to those devices by clicking on that device and connect. That's it. You don't have to keep this continuously on. Now, apart from that, the next thing what you could do is switch off printing scan. So do you know that your phone is uh, continuously scanning for a printer? You could put that off. So you could get to settings, just type in uh, printing and uh, click on the first option out here, then click on printing and you could switch this off. All right, because you don't need to connect to a printer. So this is not needed. This is going to help you improve your battery life. Next, what you could do is whatever applications you have that you are not using, you could just go through the list and you could uninstall those applications. Because if you keep a useless application, it keeps on running at the background. It uses a lot of data. That's not needed. That's going to drain out your battery. That's going to affect your battery health. Okay. So for instance, this one here, I don't need it. Just long press on the application. Or if you want to do it from settings, you can do that also and uninstall it. OK, the next thing is you could uh, force stop applications that are not being used for a long time. So you could uh, get to settings directly and uh, you could go to apps and you could see which apps are not being used for quite some time. For instance, this one, just click on that application. And if it is not available for force stop, that means it's not running this one first stop. You could stop the application and it is going to stop running in the background. Okay. Just ensure that the notifications are off and you're good. Apart from that, you could also get to settings and uh, you get to battery. You could see whatever apps are using your battery for quite some time. You could uh, stop these applications or you could clear memory. Now, for instance, WhatsApp, you could see that uh, it is using approximately 7.8% uh, of the memory or 703 Okay, you could go ahead and uh, stop the application or you could clear your WhatsApp messages. And once you do that, it is going to you know, use lesser battery powers. You also have options for power saving mode or ultra power savings mode in your Android device under the battery settings. That's also an option, but this is not needed right now. What we're trying to do is looking for a permanent solution to increase or improve battery life two or three times for whatever backup it is giving. Apart from that, another thing what you could do is turn off backup for applications. So we have Android devices and it is backed up by Google servers, basically. So if auto sync is on with the server or if backup is turned on on your Android device, your phone is continuously syncing data. So what you could do is, is you could turn that off and to turn that off, you could click on settings, click on Google, get to Google services under recommended settings. You're going to get an option to put backup on or off out here to the top. Or you could do a search and get to this directly from settings and then you could turn it off. So you could follow and do all these settings on your phone and it is 
definitely going to improve your battery life. I hope this was interesting and I hope you got some value. If you did, give my video a thumbs up. Take care, my friend. Thank you.